Hey guys. hey guys! Welcome back to the vlog and this is day 2 of our Vancouver Island trip. Yesterday we had a little bit of time so we did a little tour of our Airbnb for you guys. Welcome to the room tour! We are going to be staying here at this Airbnb tonight. But not this one, but this one! Nat and I decided that we are going to do glamping tonight and this is going to be our home. Come on in! Starting from left to right, we have our shirak here. We have our own dresser and over to this side, this is a sleeping bag and a couple of yoga mats. We have some emergency lights and bathrobes here. Over to this corner, we have a couple of blankets and I guess games for tonight? And right in the middle is our double-decker bed. So I think Nat and I can fit at the bottom tonight. At least we got some extra pillows from the top. And I guess this is our living area. This is actually larger than what we expected. It has a nice height and a good width and a cozy feeling. And over to this side, we got our dining space. You got some chairs and tables over here, more tables, some lawn chairs. And I guess these are our kitchen supplies and garbage. currently seven o'clock so i just want to quickly mention the temperature situation here in the tent we were kind of concerned yesterday that it would get a little too humid or a little too hot in here because we completely closed the windows of the tent we didn't want the bugs to come in but ultimately overnight it got colder and until now it's kind of cold in the morning and everything was fine i guess overnight we found a few roommates Here's another one. Today's breakfast is going to be on the Old Country Market or also known as Goats, goats on, on the, the roof. roof. If you guys are wondering why Goats on the Roof, it's because There's literally goats on the roof. There's goats! One s'mores, please. Will the entire marshmallow know what kind of arrived? Need a receipt? Yes, please. Awesome. Thank you. Have a wonderful Thank afternoon. You. See you guys later. Guys, so we found out that Goats on the Roof is not just a shop, but it's a whole community of little shops and stores and marketplace. So this is gonna be our breakfast. So we got the donuts from Billy G's Donuts, which is a separate shop. But we got our coffee and we're staying right here at Billy Grubb's Specialty Coffee. Do you wanna do the reveal? Yes, I'm so 
so excited. So we have here cotton candy explosion, maple bacon donut, and s'mores. I think this is a pina colada donut. Oh, what's this one? It's strawberry cheesecake, something like that. Oh, strawberry cheesecake. That's one of the most recommended here. And at the very bottom, so this is the salted caramel go to the leche donut. For our coffee, we just got a vanilla iced coffee and a cappuccino here. I'm going for the maple bacon one. They're bacon bits! <laughs> Feels like I'm having a breakfast and dessert at the same time. <laughs> the donut tastes like cinnamon but with maple syrup and on top with bacon bits. So it's kind of sweet and salty at the same time. Mm. I'm gonna go for the peanut colada donut. And I think it has filling inside. Let's see. It has like coconuts and lemons inside. It's really good. And the top one is pretty crunchy. Mm. Anything with coconut is pretty good. Next donut, Thai shoes, cotton candy explosion. Look at that. It looks like something's wrong. It doesn't really taste like a cotton candy. It tastes like a glazed donut with bits of... Sprinkles. Sprinkles. So it's a sprinkled donut. Mm -hmm. Basically. I'm gonna try out for my next donut. This is the Dulce de Leche Salted Caramel Donut. And I'm assuming it has filling inside too, of the Dulce de Leche. The dough is pretty soft, and you get that salted caramel covering on top. Mmm, right there. So guys, we are actually inside the shop where the goats are on the roof. So it turns out it's a marketplace plus a restaurant. The restaurant opens at 11, but we are currently in the marketplace right now. Let's go have a look. They have canned peanuts here. Why is it in a can? I think they did a great job of theming the shop. There's like lanterns everywhere. Everything's nice. Oh yeah, this is for the big boys right here. You'll never run out of barbecue sauce. Mustard. Mustard to taste? But it says it's mustard. <laughs> <laughs> they, they also got mayonnaise on the same packet. What? Same packaging. Ready to go? Yes. <laughs> they wanna come home with us. We officially adopted a goat. <laughs> Coming here, make sure you guys go in the beginning of the day or in the afternoon because it tends to get busy here. If you guys are concerned about parking, don't be because we've seen people parking on the streets. There's a lot of parking spots at the back here. And if you guys go all the way back, you are going to find some of the goats plus their real houses. Up close! There's one right there. Hi! You're so cute! 
so cute. I've never seen a goat up close before. If you guys check out the west side of the old country market, you'll find this plaza full of statues and surrounded by shops. <laughs> that was a fun one, right? Yep. I think it took us about all our morning. I think it's already lunch hour right now. We had too much fun with the goats. We are going to check out the Qualicum Beach before we head out to Port Alberni today. Let's go! We found the beach! We would say maybe this is about 10 minutes from the goats on the roof. This is called Qualicum Beach. Let's go closer. It's a small crab! Qualicum Beach is a pretty big beach so even if it gets busy, you can always just walk around and you can always see good spots. We are gonna check out one of the popular spots here. It's called Hole in the Wall. The wall eroded over time to have like a, a hole in it in the middle. I've seen pictures on Instagram and the internet about it. We'll just go check it out. I think we're on the right track. There's Hole in the Wall here. And also, unfortunately, we couldn't go to Macmillan Provincial Park to the famous Cathedral Grove because due to the pandemic, it's closed. Not too bad. Yeah, maybe next time. Oh, okay. there's a sign. Okay, so there's a hole in the wall right there. I think we're on the right track. Is it this way? We're getting there. Are you sure we're on the right track? Uh, maybe, I think so. Here. <laughs> <laughs> you guys can tell from our outfits that we didn't anticipate going for a hike today. <laughs> Yep, with our white shoes. <laughs> with our white shoes and our jeans. Hopefully it's not too long now. I think we're close. Don't tell me we need to go down there. I think we do. Slowly but surely. Ah. Ah. Are we there yet? I think I see it. There's a lot of people. So we are now heading back to the car. It's such a hike this one <laughs> because not only it's rocky, it's a rocky trail. It got some elevation on it too because on your way there, you're gonna go through a lot of downhill and it's the same way back up. <laughs> so a bit of suggestion for you guys when you're coming here at Hole in the Wall. The shortest hike to Hole in the Wall is the one right across the Coombs candy store. So we are now here at Port Alberni and this is gonna be home for the night. Plus, I'm getting a little tired now. Yeah, we actually did quite a lot today. We traveled from Arrington to Port Alberni and pretty much stopped at all the places that we've seen. Tomorrow is gonna be the first day in Tofino. So if you guys are new here, we'd love to keep you around. Please subscribe to our channel and like this video. And if you have any suggestions for the upcoming vlogs, let us know in the comment section down below. Until then, see you in the next vlog. And thanks for watching. Bye! Welcome to the room tour. We are going to stay here at the air. <laughs> 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 <laughs>
They have canned. <laughs> Oh, I think it's a dead crab. It's a baby crab. I think they're both dead. Do you want to go for it there? Nope. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like we're a little too excited to see the beach. <laughs> <laughs> 